Tinuday, it's your turn now. Hi guys, good morning. Today I like to talk with you about a new presentation that is help. Fourth chapter, let us play volleyball. Did you remember in your grade 6 you had learned about ball handling and footwork in volleyball and many activities connected therewith? So, Okay, let's learn about what is volleyball. Volleyball is the national sport in Sri Lanka. Most of the schools have volleyball teams because it's popular in schools all over the world. Both men and women play this game. Out of the skills volleyball, in there are two skills that, that is serving and receiving take place at the beginning of the game. So, we will learn about underarm service and underarm receive in this lesson. Okay. This picture you can see a volleyball team. Okay. Next, I'm going to talk about skills required in volleyball. So, first skill is that is serving and next receiving, setting, spiking, blocking and fail defending. There are six main skills in volleyball. So, you can see there are serving, receiving, setting, spiking, blocking, fail defending. Okay. Okay, next I'm going to talk about serving. So, serving is the sending of the ball to the opposite side of the serving area in order to the start the game. So, there are two main types of serving. There are underarm service and overarm service. In this picture you can see serving. Okay, let's learn about underarm service. Okay, in this picture you can see underarm service. So, in this underarm service, we can divide it into three stages. Okay, let's see what are they. They are before touching the ball, touching the ball and after touching the ball. Okay, let's talk about stage before touching the ball. So, I'm going to tell this step. By step, place the ball on the palm of your free hand and place the foot off the same side in front. Next, move the streaking hand slightly behind your body. Next, balance yourself giving greater weight to the back foot. Next, look straight while inclining your body forward. This picture you can see before touching the ball. Okay, next I'm going to talk about touching the ball. Okay, toss the ball off a little and sweetly move the shrinking hand close to your body and shrink the button of the ball. In this, sec uh, in this picture you can see the touching the ball. Okay, next I'm going to talk about stage touching, touching the ball. Okay. Yeah, after 
trick in the ball move the hand forward move your back foot forward and keep your balance this picture you can see stage after touching the ball okay next i'm going to talk about receiving receiving the is receiving is the ball served by the opposite team in this picture you can see receiving okay let's learn it further okay, there are two types of receiving they are underarm receiving and overarm receiving so next i'm going to talk about underarm receive the underarm receive can be learned under three stages they are before touching the ball touching the ball and after touching the ball okay let's learn about before touching the ball Uh, legs should be kept apart at or about shoulder with the relaxed and your body weight must be equally borne by both legs bend your knees slightly inclining your body forward keep your hands on other side of your body and the eyes on the moving the ball next keep your body relaxed In this picture, you can see before touching the ball. Next, I'm going to talk about touching the ball. Fully stretch both hands, keeping them together as shown in this figure, and the muscles area in the lower apart from the land should be kept completely relaxed, and lower the hands from the wrist. next rise as you make contact with the ball with the hand next control your hands according to the speed of the ball and hit it apart okay next i'm going to talk about touching the ball After attacking the ball, move your hands back to the sides of your body. Next, balance yourself by placing in front either of your feet as convenient. Okay. In this picture, you can see after touching the ball. Okay, I'm going to wind up my presentation. I think you all can understand my lesson clearly, guys. Do you have any problem? Okay, I think you. I hope you guys, you all can understand my lesson clearly. My lesson is over. Let's meet another presentation till then. Excellent presentation.